Okay, hello guy and welcome back to Retron channel on YouTube. So in today video, I'm going to do a quick tutorial on how you actually deactivate your iCloud account from your Apple Watch. So normally when you sell your Apple Watch to somebody else, then you might find some issue with iCloud. Sometimes you unpair the watch from the phone already but still the iCloud is still attached and existed on your Apple watch so whenever the new owner of your watch try to reconnect reactivate the the watch they will end up seeing or facing the watch itself asking to re-enter the iCloud of the previous owner so how how do you actually uh, bypass this or how to actually uh, clear all the data and especially the iCloud and prevent from it stuck into your Apple Watch. Okay, so it's very simple and very easy. Of course, it's also very straightforward. So what you need to do is to actually go into your phone. If you are the owner of the your of the previous watch or the watch that you are trying to sell to, to sell to someone you just simply go to uh, watch app on your phone your iPhone go to watch and then you see the word all watch right then you tap on it and then you choose the one that you are currently own it, or the one that you plan to sell to someone okay so now I have I have a uh, switch to this one so if you unable to switch back to any of the watch just simply toggle off the auto switch and then you got the uh, uh, you got the right to select which watch you want to put it in I'm gonna speak back to auto switch okay click on done so now first of all you actually some people are actually need to unpair the watch but for my recommendation, you don't need to unpair the watch. You just simply go into Find My. Go to Find My. Yep, go there. In there, you just simply go into the watch that you uh, name it. For example, like this one, I name it as a uh, 40mm S4, the one that I'm holding in here. So this one is actually attached to my I mean it linked it to my iCloud so I just simply want to sell this out to someone else so I don't need it anymore then I need to go into my find my app on my iPhone and then go find your watch so this is the watch this is the one and then you press on it after that you go into remove this device click on remove this device now you will ask to type in the password and everything so that you can have this remove i'm gonna click on remove and then i'm gonna key in the password ah it's got me auto key in I'll click ok so after a few moments it will remove completely remove the device from uh i mean completely remove the device from the find my and also removing iCloud from your Apple Watch as well. So your Apple Watch is still operate normally. It's not reset or anything. You need to manually reset it again so that you can pair with another device.